Los Angeles, California, the city of angels, is the site for another great college football showdown. There's still a lot of warm air out there for tonight's battle between the USC Trojans and the Bruins of UCLA. Hi, everybody. Brad Nessler, Lee Corso, and Kirk Herbstreit here to bring you all the action of this football game. LA is rocking today as these crosstown rivals will have at it for the victory bell. Now let's take it down to the head referee at midfield for the coin toss. Brought to you by Coca-Cola. Both teams have sent their special teams onto the field, and we're ready for the opening kickoff. Kicks it off. Number 34 takes it at the 8. Brought down at the 29 yard line. Now let's see what kind of success this offense can have as they come out onto the field for the first time today. As a coach, you got to be concerned with what the defense is throwing at you. I tell my quarterback to take what the defense has given you. The offense lines up with three wide receivers. Back to pass. Surveys the field. Looking long to the right. Tipped away. You got to be careful throwing into coverage like that. Well, coach, I don't think it was a poor decision. It was just a great reaction by the man in coverage. We've got an exciting game on our hands today, and a crucial part of this game is going to be the matchup between the left end and the right tackle. This left defensive end is a monster out there, and blocking him is not easy. You got that right. This defensive end is a quarterback's worst nightmare. Look out! He's going to be causing chaos in the backfield all game long. Third down and 10 coming up. Ball on their own 29. Number 25, the lone back. And he drops back. Looks, looking deep to the right. And that one's incomplete. Number eight was the intended receiver on the play. And they're going to have to bring on the punt team. It's fourth down. The Trojans line up the punt. Number 28 is back deep to return the punt. Punts the ball away. Number 28 fields it for 30. And down he goes at the 37-yard line. Great start so far as their defense forced the early punt. And now the offense gets a shot at putting the first points on the board. We've got a first and 10. Two tight end set. Here's the draw. They'll bring him down for a loss on the play. The defense was all over that one. He had very good containment on the halfback. He had nowhere to go with the football. It's second and 11. Ball on the 37-yard line. The Bruins line up in an eye formation. Setting up the play action. Throws. How about that defense? Well, that's why he's on the field, to make plays like that. From their own 37-yard line. It's third down. Number three with three wide receivers. He drops back. Looking. Wants to throw outside. It's complete. He goes down at the 30-yard line. Good pickup for the first down. Hey, hey, Kirk. Forget about the first down. How about that big chunk of yards they just picked up on that play? Yep, it definitely put them in better field position. And I just have a feeling that they're going to punch it into the end zone on this drive. Number three comes to the line with three wide. He jukes. Zero yards on that play. No gain on the play. I'd spread the ball around here. Keep that defense on their toes. Second and ten. Ball on the 30-yard line. The Bruins come out in a two-time end set. Back to pass. He looks. Looking deep to the right. And got him! What a strike for the score. And he did a nice job of looking off his defenders. They'll line it up for the extra point. The 
The kick is up, and he adds the extra point. And here's the Pontiac drive summary. UCLA is lining up to kick this one off. He sends it off. Number 22 has it at the 5. And down he goes at the 27. So before the offense hits the field, let's take the time to let you know that our game is brought to you by EA Sports. We've got a first and 10. Raw play. He's taken down at the 30. Just about three yards there. That'll bring up second down. From their own 30-yard line, it's second down. They line up in an eye. Setting up the play action. Aaron and out long. It's knocked away incomplete. That's just good defense right there, Coach. It was, Kurt, but you know what? It's all reaction. Anytime you're out there on defense and the pass is within arm's length Third away, you knock it down. Third and seven yard. coming up here. USC comes to the line with three wide. Ready. Point, he drops back. Surveys the field. Let's it go. And it's knocked down. Nice play by the defense to bring up fourth down. Yeah, instead of going for the interception, they did the safe thing, and that was just to tip it away. Fourth, Fourth down. Seven. The Trojans line up the punt. Number 28 line. awaiting the return. In the punt. <laughs> it's away and it's a booming punt. Number 28 takes it to 28 and they make the stop at the 34-yard line. They're ready to start another drive, hoping to duplicate the results of the last one, which ended in a touchdown. First, First and 10. ten. Ball on the 34-yard line. Number three with three wide receivers. Back to pass. He's looking. Fires deep down the right side. Has it to the senior. I thought I was paying attention here, but I looked up and pow! The guy's got 100 yards receiving already. When did that happen? Coach, I'm wondering the same thing. He's having a great game out there today. First We've got ten. a first and ten. Ball on the 17 yard line. They find themselves in the red zone for the first time today. Drops back to pass. He passes it. Got it to the senior. Seven yards there. I'm full of good plays. Try this one. Second and three. Ten yards to the end zone. Single set back there. Back to pass. Surveys the field. And that one's fallen incomplete. Underthrown in the vicinity of his tight end. He's a big guy who can rumble after the catch. You gotta hit him squarely. It's third and three. Ball on the 10. They're lining up in the 5-2. Setting up the play action. Dumps it. Now who's the penalty gonna be called on here? Passing the clearance on the defense. He earned that yellow flag, guys. Yep, he worked hard to break up that pass. A little too hard. First UCLA can smell the end zone as they look to extend this lead. Number 28 is the deep back as they line up in the eye. They bring him down in the backfield. Not a very successful run that time, Coach. Did you see his explosion off the defensive line? Woohoo! It seemed like he was in the backfield before the ball was even snapped. He just timed the snap count there and really made a nice play. He drops back. He throws. Caught out of bounds. Incomplete. Great effort here by the wideout. But you know what? The quarterback was off just enough to cause the incompletion. This is a big play for the offense that can put him up by two scores. It's third down from the four. 
UCLA comes to the line, only one man in the backfield. They'll drop him for a loss. It was a defensive lineman that got a hold of him there. And when that kid gets a hold of you, then you usually go down. And you're not going to break many tackles when this guy gets his hands on you. Number seven could make it a two-score game. He gets it up. And they tack on three points. And now we're going to take a look at the Pontiac drive summary. And it looks like they're ready for the kickoff. Number 22. And it's off. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. Not a very good series for this offense on their last drive as they were forced into a three and out. Boy, oh boy, they had nothing going last time. Yeah, maybe, Scooter, you need to get out there and show them what you're made of. Somebody get me a helmet quickly. UCLA brings in their nickel package. There's a play fake. He tosses it short, catches it. Down the sideline. At the 40, at the 30, to the 20, to the 10. He's going to take it to the barn. Touchdown. Hey, coach, was that a fine pass play or what? Uh, or what is right, this young man is a complete package of quarterback. He knows where his receivers will be, and he gets a quick release to them in a big, big hurry. The kick is up, and he hits the PAT. That score leads us to our Pontiac drive summary. USC gets set to kick this one away. Number 28, deep to return. And it's off. Number 36, fields it at the 7. Bounces off the rookie tackler. Brought down at the 23-yard line. The offense goes back out onto the field after picking up a field goal on their last drive from their own 23-yard line. It's first down. Single set backfield. Play action under pressure. The defense got some pressure and forced a bad pass. I think they've been a little bit more aggressive here with their pass rush, and that time it paid off with an incompletion. It's second down and 10 to go. Ball on the 23-yard line. Number three comes to the line with three wide. On the ground with the tailback. And down he goes at the 26. So the old counter gets two, maybe three yards. It's third and seven. Ball on the 26-yard line. The defense comes out with five defensive backs this time. They hand it off. He's tackled at the 30-yard line. They tried to run on third down, but they couldn't pick up the first. They almost fooled them with the run there. It worked. Nice call by the coordinator, though. I know they didn't get the first, but they kept the defense getting. Fourth and three. It's fourth down. Looks like they're going to punt it away here. Number six awaits the snap. He really got a hold of that one. Back to return. Number 39 takes it to 25, and he's taken down at the 34. They did a great job on their last drive, moving the ball down the field for a touchdown. Let's see if they can duplicate that on this drive. They line up at the 34. First down. They'll throw on first down. Looks. He airs it out. And he's taken down at the 21-yard line. This kid just continues to impress us with his ability to catch the football. He's already gone over 100 yards here in the first half. Good answer, defense. Who wants to cover this guy? I bet you nobody's going to raise their hand because this receiver is embarrassing. Number 82 was the intended target on the play. That'll bring up second down. They line up at the 21. Second down. They keep it on the ground with the tailback. Tackle at the six. Picked up big yards there, and he's going to have a first down. Yeah, nice job there. This guy does a good job in reading his blocks and accelerating through the holes. 
First down. He'll try to get it in from the five-yard line. Number 10 with three wide receivers. Another run. They'll bring him down at the two. Four-yard gain by the back. You've got to go out there and compete. Be a competitor. Second and goal. Ball on the two-yard line. They're crowding that line of scrimmage. Play action. He's in trouble. Oh, what a hit. The fifth-year senior at linebacker drops the quarterback to the ground for a sack. you got to love a kid with this kind of mentality on defense. He's just so tough out there. And I remember when they were recruiting him years ago, they almost stuck him at fullback. Well, it was obviously a good decision to make him a linebacker. USC sets up with four receivers. There's a play fake. Throws it. They're going to go for the easy three here. USC is down three and looking to tie it up. It's up. And he's got it. So we take a moment to check out the Pontiac drive summary. USC to kick, number 36, and number 28, back deep to return. He sends it downfield. Number 36, fields it at the 9. They'll bring him down at the 25. This defense did a good job on the last series. They forced the offense to go three plays and out. And now they're looking to build off of that and shut him down First again right here. First and 10. On the 25-yard line. Number 28 is the single setback. Set. Here's the give. Locked down at the 29 yard line. Number 28 gets about four yards on the play. It's second and six. Ball on their own 29. Number 28 lines up as a single back. They go with the run, and he tackles him hard at the 32-yard line. The back gets three on the carry. Third down and three coming up. Ball on their own 32. Two tight ends here. They keep it on the ground. And down he goes at the 39-yard line. And they convert the first down on that run. And the key to that play is a good blocking up front by the Hog Mollies. You're right. And those are the kind of runs that you need to have a first successful and offense. First and 10. 39-yard line. Number 28, the lone back. Set. Three 90. Huh? Gets the ball. No, they faked it. Across the middle. Got it to the senior. The pass results in a first down. I'll tell you, great call by the coaches on first down. It stretches the defense when they're expecting the run, and then they end up with another first down. The offense lines up with three wide receivers. Let's go! Green 95! Green 95! They'll throw on first down. Looks. He throws it. And it's knocked away. And that was a good defensive play. Yeah, guys, this is because he's in great position to make the play. Second and ten. Ball on the 50-yard line. The Bruins line up with three wide. Again, he'll get the call. What a collision. They go with a run, and that'll be a gain of nine. This is where you just go with what you know the best. The defense will try to stop this third down as they were unsuccessful the first time on this drive. 
The Bruins come out of the two tight end set. He's taken down at the 37-yard line. Another carry for this kid, and he'll get the first down. He's been pretty reliable on this drive, Kirk. He's carrying this offense on his back right now. And I think they'll keep giving him the ball until the defense figures out a way to stop him. The Bruins go with the eye formation. There's a play fake. Looks. He's looking for six. Incomplete. Almost picked off. That could have been a big play for the defense. And even though he had a good shot at picking it off, it's still a heck of a play to force the incomplete pass. Second down and 10 to go. Ball on the 37-yard line. Number three with three wide receivers. He drops back. He looks. Throws it out there. Complete. And he's hit immediately. So they pick up quite a few yards on that play, Kirk. Well, that was an excellent route, and he did a great job of holding on to the football. First Here's play number 10 on the drive. On the 22 yard line. The Bruins go with the eye formation. Drops back to pass. He's looking for his man. Incomplete. It's knocked down by the defense. That's just a great defensive play. It won't look like much in the stat book, but that's getting the job done. It's second and 10. This is the 11th play of this drive. UCLA sets up in the eye. Setting up the play action. Rose almost intercepted. The offense caught a break there. That was not a very good pass by this quarterback. Yeah, Coach, he threw it right into the hands of the defender. He's lucky that he couldn't hold on to it. That's why this kid is on defense and not offense. They come out with three wide receivers. He drops back. Surveys the field. Lets it fly. And it's caught. Hold everything, folks. There's a marker down. Let's get the call. That's an appearance on the defense. And a nice catch by the receiver for the touchdown. Anytime you're near the red zone, you got to keep an eye for this guy. They love going to him down here. So the kicker lines up for the PAT. He gets it up. He makes the PAT. And now we'll take a look at the Pontiac drive summary. UCLA, UCLA lines, lines up, up for the kickoff. For the kickoff. Return. He kicks it off. Number 22 fields it at the two. He's tackled at the 23. Just about ready to call the first play of this drive. They were able to pick up a field goal on their last possession. First it's first and 10. ten. Ball on their own 23. Number 25 lines up with a single back. They hand it off. They'll bring him down at the 26. The back gets three on the carry. Let's see what those big fellows on the line are made of. Second and eight. Ball on their own 26. 26 yard line. USC lines up in a pro set. Back to pass. Looks. Throws it. At the 45. Now that was a good looking play. The quarterback put it where his receiver could get it, and now they have a first down. What I like is the faith that this quarterback has in his receiver. He's not afraid to throw it downfield. First and 10. Number 25 lines up in the deep back, eye formation. On the ground with the tailback. Excellent open field tackle. Number 25 gets seven yards on the play. That'll make it second down. Second and four. Ball on the 38. On the 38 yard line. We've played a quarter and our score. The Bruins, 17. The Trojans, 10. USC. A team that can run the ball has the best chance of winning. So I try to establish the run here. And they'll run him again. Tackle at the 
the 34. And he carried that one for a few yards. You know, when you have a guy that can grab five yards or so consistently, it sure takes some of the pressure off the passing game. First and 10, ball on the 34. USC goes with the ace set here. There's the play fake. Looking, he throws it. Catches it, and they tackle him at the four yard line. So they go to the air and they pick up yet another first down. They've shown no problems moving the ball on this drive. This offense is moving the ball very well, and they're building some beautiful momentum along the way. The defense looks confident as they held him to a field goal on their last red zone trip. Touchdown, Trojans. Good idea giving it to the halfback near the end zone. Why would you give it to this guy? He told me before the game, if he gets the ball inside the 10, you can five-star lock him. He's going to score. It's up. He splits the uprights with the extra point. And here's the Pontiac drive summary. Number 19 is, is lined up to kick this one off. Number 36. Decent kick. Number 36 fields it at the 7. Gets past the tackler. And he's taken down at the 25. The offense ready for the first play of this drive. They moved the ball extremely well on their last possession on their way to the end zone. We've got a first and 10. Ball on the 25-yard line. Number 28 is the single setback. They hand it off. And he's taken down at the 29. They got four yards on that one. I love a good draw play. You got the defense thinking pass, then you run the ball for a nice game. One man backfield. Drops back to pass. Looking. Looking long down the left side. And they finally push him out at the 39. Great play to keep his feet in and get the first down. It takes tremendous concentration and field awareness to make a play like that. And the quarterback put it in a place where only his receiver could catch it. Nice throw. UCLA comes out of an eye formation. There's the play face. Let's it fly. They connect again. And they make the stop at the 15. And a pretty smart call right there. You're absolutely right. The reason why this play worked is that the play action throws the defense just enough to allow the receiver to get open. We've got a first and 10. Ball on the 15-yard line. The pressure turns up when in the red zone. And that's when you turn to Old Spice red zone, when performance matters the most. He gets another carry. They'll bring him down at the 15-yard line. Nothing going on that one. That'll make it second down. They line up at the 15. Second down. The Bruins line up with three wide. They'll give it off here. He sheds it. Tackle at the seven. Number 28 gains around eight yards on the run. So that'll make it third down. Third down. Let's see if they can put it in from six yards out. UCLA comes out with an eye formation. They'll go with the run once again. Broke away from one. So they keep it on the ground and they get their third first down of the drive. Yeah, this is a pretty good looking drive, don't you think, Coach? Yes, sir. The offense is in rhythm right now. They are running well and blocking well. And they're wearing down this defense. The longer a drive goes, the more the advantage goes to the offense. Number 36 is the deep back as they line up in the eye. And they'll get him in the backfield. And they're going the wrong way, Coach. Hey, Brad, if you don't have offensive balance, you can't keep the defense off of you. It's second down, only five yards away from the goal line. Two tight ends here. Handoff up the middle. Touchdown, UCLA! And they punch it in on the ground. Man, he's a good-looking player, and he's showing us why they wanted him so badly coming out of high school. So the kicking team will line up for the point after. It's up, and he tacks on the extra point. And now we're going to take a look at the Pontiac drive summary.
They line up to kick this one away. He kicks it off. Number 34 fields it at the two. Yuku brought down at the 24 yard line. They're ready to start another drive, hoping to duplicate the results of the last one, which ended in a touchdown. First down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 24. Number 25, blown back. Play action. He looks. He's in trouble. Oh, man, did he take a hit. So the sack makes this a second and long. They're changing the play. Drops back to pass. Looks. Goes up it short. Incomplete. He just missed his target that time. Yeah, you're right. The tight end had no chance at the ball at all. Third, Third and down and, and a couple miles ball here. Ball on the 15-yard line. The Trojans go with the eye formation. Back to pass. He's looking. Going deep on the left side. Batted away. Number two was the intended target. So the defense stands their ground, and they're going to have to punt this ball away. Fourth, and Fourth down. The punter ball comes on the field, getting ready to send one off. Number 16 is the punter. Booming kick. Number 28 builds it to 41. And down he goes at the 50. They move the ball very effectively on their last drive, which ended with a touchdown. The defense has been talking it over on the sideline, trying First to make some 10. corrections. Let's see Ball if they can the stop them this time. Line. First and 10. Ball on the 50. Number 28 lines up as a single back. There's a the play fake. They bring the quarterback down. So the sack makes this a second and long. Drop back to pass. Looking, he lets it go. This one should be interesting. Pass on the parents, on the defense. That was a good call. The defender was all over. Sometimes holding up a defender is better than letting him go for a big game. Or even worse, a touchdown. First down, 10 to go. Number three with three wide receivers. Play action. He's under pressure. Long ball, right side. It's broken up. You got to be careful throwing in the coverage like that. Well, Coach, I don't think it was a poor decision. It was just a great reaction by the man in coverage. Second down and 10 to go. Ball in the 47. They come out with three wide receivers. Drops back to pass. He's looking. Looking deep to the right. Swatted away. Coach, you made a nice defensive play there. He sure did. He just stuck his hand out and hit the football. It's third and ten. Number 28 lines up as a single back. He drops back. He's looking. Throws to the middle. They can't connect. Incomplete. It sailed over the receiver's head. Yeah, this receiver is fast, but not that fast. So it's fourth down, and they're ready to punt this one away. Number six is waiting for the snap. He gets it away, and this is a really nice punt. The defense really shut these guys down the last time they had the ball. The offense looked a bit out of sync on that last possession, Coach. And it was the defense that threw them out of sync, Kirk. Those guys are fired up. Let's see if they can hold them again. Number 10 comes to the line. Three wide. Back to pass. Looking. Waits till the last moment. And they're going to get somebody for interference on that play. Let's see who the call is on. On the defense. He got to the receiver a bit too soon there. You won't get much of an argument from me. That was a good call. First down, 10 yards to go. Ball on their own 35. Yard. 
USC goes with the ace set here. Nice play fake. Here they come. It's complete. He's taken down at the 50-yard line. Our cameraman didn't even know who had the ball. I'm pretty sure the defense didn't either. The halfback did a heck of a job faking like he was running with the ball. Hit. <laughs> they were about to tackle him. They line up at the 50. It's first down. The Trojans go with the eye formation. Gets the ball. No, they faked it. He looks. He lets it go. Number 23 has an interception. And a great set of hands by the defender on that one. How about that, Kirk? We spent the whole week talking to some of his teammates. No one told us he could catch like that. You're right, Coach. I wonder if this guy played both ways in high school. First and ten. First down, ten ball yards to go. Ball on their own 35. The offense lines up with three wide receivers. Setting up the play action. He's under pressure. He throws it. Tackle at the 49-yard line. They pick up a few yards there on the pass. And I'll tell you what, that fake handoff froze the secondary just enough to allow for the receiver to come up with a nice gain that time. Good call. Ace backfield. Play action. Looking. Home run ball in the air. Got him again. And they bring him down at the two-yard line. A little trickery by the quarterback paid off in a big way. I think they caught the safeties looking in the backfield at the running back. And the receivers ran right by them. The offense got six the last time they were inside the 20. Let's see what they do here. Number 28, cross it. Number 28, sweeps up the loose ball. And that one's recovered by the cornerback. You usually don't see corners down there picking up loose balls. They're more worried about interceptions. Well, you know what they say, great players make great plays, and that, my friend, was a great play. Number 25, thrown in the backfield. Gets the ball, no, they fake it, he throws it. And it's incomplete. Number eight was the intended target, so that'll make it second down. So it's second and ten. Ball on the 16-yard line. They come out with three wide receivers. They keep it on the ground with a tailback. Tackle made at the 16. He got back to the line of scrimmage, but not much more. That'll bring up third down. Third and ten. Ball on their own 16. 16-yard line. Number 25 is the single setback. He drops back. He's looking. Looking deep to the right. Incomplete pass. Number eight was the intended receiver on that pass. So that'll make it fourth down. Fourth down. The Trojans line up the punt. Number 16, the punt. Punts the ball away. Number 28, fields it to the 42. They'll bring him down at the 46. I'm sure the defense will be trying to strip the ball once again. And if these kids don't start hanging on to the football, they won't see another offensive series. They might start putting in some of those defensive players that really want to play bad. UCLA comes out with an eye formation. Gets the ball. No, they faked it. Hit as he throws. He got the ball away, but it wasn't anywhere near a completion. Nah, he just wanted to avoid the sack. Second down and 10 to go. Ball on their own 46. Number 28 is the deep back as they line up in the eye. Nice play fake. He's looking for his man. And it's knocked down. Number 26 was the intended target. That'll make it third down. It's a big down right here. You got to throw in this situation. Third it's third and 10. And ten. Ball on the 46. 46 yard line. They come out with three wide receivers. Drop back to pass. He's looking. Throws. And that one's fallen incomplete. Number 26 was the intended receiver on that pass. That's going to bring up fourth down. It's fourth down. UCLA ready to put this one away. Number 39 is back awaiting the punt. 
Number six, punts it, and this is a wonderful kick. And they'll down it at the six. That was sure a great punt, Kirk. It's really hard to drive down the field when the offense has to start First this deep in their own territory. First down, ten to go. Ball on their own six. Number ten with four wide receivers. Setting up the play action. He lets it go deep down the middle. Incomplete pass. Well, they went for the home run on that one. Oh, if he didn't throw the ball so far, they'd be looking at six right now. Second it's second and ten. And ten. Ball on the six yard line. USC goes with the ace set here. Nice play fake. Throw in left. And it's knocked away. Number two was the intended receiver on that pass. That'll bring up third down. We've got third and ten. Ball on the six yard line. UCLA brings in the nickel package. He drops back. He throws it. Batted away. And that makes it fourth down. Boy, great defense on that play. They were expecting the pass, and they defended it very well by getting a hand in there to break up the play. Fourth it's fourth down. Ten. The Trojans the are lining up to punt it away. Number 28, back deep to return. He puts it away, and it's a great kick. Number 28, fields up the 50, and he's tackled at the 49-yard line. Not a whole lot of success their last time out. Not at all. This offense has to do a better job of staying on the field and giving their defense a chance to catch first their breath. We've got a first and 10. Ball on the 49. Ace backfield. They'll give it off here. And they make the stop at the 49. No gain. So that'll make it second down. A good running game will do wonders for your football team. It allows you to set the tempo of the game and gives your defense time to rest on the sidelines. UCLA sets up in the eye. And they'll run him again. They'll wrestle him down in the backfield. And that was a good stop by the defense. They got him in the backfield. That's a great example of quickness by the defensive line. It allows you to break away from those blockers before they have a chance of moving you away from the play. The Bruins come out in the ace formation. He drops back. Surveys the field. Throws it out there. It's batted down. Incomplete. And that makes it fourth down. Boy, great defense on that play. They were expecting the pass, and they defended it very well by getting a hand. It's fourth down. The Bruins line up to punt. Number six is the punter. And this one is a beauty. So the offense takes over, and the last time they had the ball, they had a tough time getting anything going. We've got a first and ten. Ball on the 20. USC comes out with three receivers bunch. Gets the ball. No, they faked it. Let's it go. Well, the defender was all over him on that play. Here's the call by the referee. Pass the parents on the defense. Well, they flagged the defender for interference. What do you Push guys down. think? Yo, I think he got a bum rap on that one. I don't know, coach. I thought he got in there a little bit too First soon. Down. First down, 10 Ball yards to go. Yard Ball on their own 28. The Trojans come out in a two tight end set. Here's the give. He's hit and got away. And down he goes at the 32. A pickup of four on the play. A team that can run the ball has the best chance of winning. So I try to establish the run here. Ball on the 32 yard line. The Trojans line up with four wide out. He drops back. And he's hammered as he lets it go. Great concentration. Nice little arc on that pass. That was a well thrown ball. They have got him. Who set it down? They line up at the 46. First down. One man backfield. Drops back to pass. 
Surveys the field. He sails it long. Oh, boy, almost intercepted. Boy, that was a good defensive effort there. The ball was there, but the defender beat the receiver to it. Nice play. It's second down and 10 to go. Number 25 lines up as a single back, looking. Throws it. Complete. And he's tackled at the 43-yard line. They're moving the ball very well on this drive, guys. Yep, the defense is preventing the deep ball, but the problem is they can't stop the short stuff. And the offense seems to be building a little bit more momentum on every play. Good job there by the defense to get a hand on it. It was, Kirk, but when you're going out for a pass and a ball is in the air, you need to go after it and come down with it. You just can't watch the defender bat it down. You'll get it again. Missed tackle. That's four yards on the play. That was a great hit by the defender. He just drove the ball carrier right to the ground. Now it's third and six coming up. Ball on the 39. Single set back to it. He passes it. Caught. He's tackled at the 21. And they pick up the first down with a pass to the tight end. It's easy to forget about the tight end sometimes coming off the line. But you always have to watch this guy because he's certainly capable of making big plays. Four-yard gain by the back. USC will take their second time out of the half. It's second down and six to go. Ball on the 17. The Trojans come out in the A formation. Again, he'll get the call. Unbelievable. They can't get this offense off the field. Well, they've been like a machine on this drive. Very methodical and efficient. And once again, moving the chain. Here's a draw. Brought down at the four. So they get five yards there on the halfback draw. Second down. The ball is on the floor, and they're going in. Pressure coming, and he's going to come up with a sack. The tackle got embarrassed that time, allowing the end to come free for the sack. That's what you call a lookout block. The tackle gets beat and yells, look out! Trust me, it's not what you want to hear as a quarterback. Drops back to pass. He throws, and it's incomplete. Number 83, the intended receiver on the play. They'll line up for the field goal, and this is nothing more than a chip shot. The holder's on the 19, so this will be about a 29-yarder. The kick is up. That score leads us to our Pontiac drive summary. They line up to kick this one away. Number 36. Decent kick. Number 36 takes it for the six. Breaks one. And down he goes at the 27. Yo, the defense really stepped up to force that three and out on the last drive. Yeah, the offense wasn't clicking on their last possession. We'll see if they have things figured out on this next drive. The Bruins come out showing three wide. Drops back to pass. He's looking. Throws it deep downfield. It's broken up. You know, the quarterback didn't do anything wrong there. This is just a great play defensively. I think he underestimated the speed of the defensive player. He just shot in and broke it up. They line up in an eye. They keep it on the ground with a tailback. He's taken down at the 28. The gain of one. It's third down and nine to go. Third and nine. The defense calls an audible. Back to pass. Looks over the middle. This one is incomplete. We've seen quite a bit of offense here as we reach halftime. Our score is UCLA 24. USC 20. USC is set to kick this ball off to start the second half. And this one's away. Number 28 fields it to 17. And he's tackled at the 36 yard line. Time once again for this offense to come back out and start another drive. First and 10. Ball on their Ball own 36. On 36 yard line.
They line up in an eye. Play action. Surveys the field. Lofting it out. Got a man wide open. To the 20. And he's all the way in for the touchdown. And that's the second time today these guys have been able to hook up for the score. Boy, he really looks comfortable in that end zone, doesn't he? And they're lining up for the PAT. He gets it up, and he tacks on the extra point. So we take a moment to check out the Pontiac drive summary. UCLA is ready to kick it away. Number 22 and number 34 keep to return. Decent kick. Number 22 has it at the five. He's taken down at the 28. And now we'll see the offense come out of the field for their next possession. First and ten. up two yards with a carry. Give it to the halfback on this sneaky draw play. It's second down and eight to go. All on their own 30. USC comes to the line. Only one man in the backfield. Set. Point 98. Point 98. Again with the run. He's tackled at the 42. And the tailback picks up great yardage on the run. How many times did we see him run that play in practice this week? A thousand times. And it was just First as successful down. then Ball as it is right now. Yard. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 42. Number 25 lines up as a single back. Gets the ball. No, they faked it. He's looking for his man. It's complete. And he finally steps out at the 33. And a big catch by the tight end. Yeah, that was big. And I'll tell you what, that tight end can really move. First down, 10 yards to go. Single set backfield. They'll keep it on the ground again. And they make the stop at the 27-yard line. Number 25 gets six yards on the carry. That'll make it second down. It's second and four to go. Ball on the 27-yard line. Back to pass. Surveys the field. Throws. Tipped away. Number eight was the intended receiver on that pass. That'll make it third down. They may be expecting pass here. So maybe a little sneaky draw play might work. On the 27 yard line. Number 25 lines up as a single back. Play action. He's looking for his man. And it falls incomplete. So it's fourth down. This is a 44-yard field goal attempt. Number 19 can make this a one-possession game with this kick. He gets it up. And it's right down the middle. And now we'll take a look at the Pontiac drive summary. USC gets set to kick this one away. Number 36. 
He kicks it off. Number 36 takes from the 10. He's taken down at the 27. Their last drive ended with a touchdown. Let's see what happens on this possession. They line up at the 27. First down. UCLA comes out with an eye formation. Here's a little draw play. He's taken down at the 29. Two-yard pickup. That'll bring up second down. It's second and eight. Ball to 29. Number 28 lines up in the deep back. High formation. There's a play fake. He passes it. Oh, he had the pick and he dropped it. That ball should have been picked off. This quarterback had too much faith in his arm that time. Well, that confidence almost led to a change of possession. His man wasn't even close to being open. Ace backfield. He drops back. Looks. He passes it. They can't connect. Incomplete. Number 26 was the intended target. So the defense stands their ground, and they're going to have to punt this ball away. So it's fourth down. The Bruins line up the punt. Number 39, the return man. And this one is a beauty. Number 39 takes it to 25, and he hits him hard at the 30. A scoring drive the last time out for this offense, and they'll huddle up for this drive. This is what power football is all about. You've got to be able to run between the tackles. Ten. Ball on the 30-yard line. Number 25 lines up as a single back. Up the middle. And he stopped behind the line. The D lineman wasn't letting anyone by him that time. And the big fella did a heck of a job plugging up the hole where that play was supposed to go. That guy's so big, Kirk, he doesn't plug up holes. He plugs up the whole line down there. Yo. Ready. Ready, team. He drops back. He looks. He throws. That's incomplete. Number 83 was the intended receiver on the play. So that'll make it third down. Tell your kids that this is where they earn their stripes. Third and 13 coming up. Ball on the 27-yard line. Number 10 comes to the line with three wide. Ready! Drops back to pass. He's looking. Going long. Taken down at the 34 yard line. Coach, you got something for us there? Yes, I do. With that last throw, he's thrown for over 300 yards in this game. I know the defensive coordinator is first kicking and, and howling right Ball now on the, the sidelines. We've got a first and 10. Number 25 is the deep back as they line up in the eye. You'll get it again. Yeah, great upfield rush here by the defensive end. He comes around and manages to get his hands on the ball carrier. That's a terrific play. Second down and 10 to go. Ball on the 34. The Trojans line up with three wide. He drops back, surveys the field. Here's the long ball, left side. He caught it for the touchdown. That pass was coming, and it'll be six. You gotta be kidding me. How do you do that? They need to tie it up here, and that's exactly why they're going for two. Number 10 with three wide receivers. He's got the two. And here's the Pontiac drive summary. Number 19 gets set to kick this one away. Number 36. He kicks it. Number 36 has it at the five. And down he goes at the 25. The defense really shut these guys down the last time they had the ball. The offense looks a bit out of sync on that last possession, Coach. And it was the defense that threw him out of sync, Kirk. 
Those guys are fired up. Let's see if they can hold them again. Number three comes to the line with three wide. Play action. Long ball, right side. Complete. And they tackle him at the 32. Perfect time for the play action pass. Well, here the defense is looking for the run, and the play action put them in even a worse position. They just weren't ready for the pass there. First they line up at the 32. The First 32 down. Yard line. The Bruins line up in an eye formation, which is right. Tackle for a loss. They didn't let him get anything going on that play. No, they didn't. Heck, they didn't even let him get back to the line of scrimmage. Second and 11. Ball on the 33-yard line. Number 28, the lone back. They'll give it off here. They bring him down in the backfield. And he was pretty much stuffed on that run. You know what, that was just a nice job by the defense in stopping him before he could get going and build up momentum. Third and 11 coming up here. Ball on the 33. Number 28, alone in the backfield. Back to pass. He looks. He's going right. Almost picked off. How about that play, Coach? Kirk, that's exactly how you teach a player to defend the pass. Do anything possible to disrupt the play. You don't necessarily have to make the interception to make a big play on defense. That's very true. Now they'll have a fourth down situation. It's up. And he's got it. And that was a long, long field goal. Boy, that kid can sure kick the football. UCLA, ready to kick this one off. Number 22, and number 34, set to return, and it's off. Number 22, fields it at the two, flag on the play. Two move, flag down, and I'm not sure when it was thrown. Let's find out. Clipping, in the receiving team. That one's gonna put him way back. You just can't block a player from behind like that, or it's gonna cost you. We've got a first and ten. Ball on the 13-yard line. They hand it off. And he hits him hard at the 11-yard line. That's a two-yard loss. And he took a shot on that play, Brad. It looks like his head might be still ringing a little bit. From their own 11-yard line. Second down. The Bruins bring in their dime package. Drops back to pass. Looking. Wants to go long and die. Number eight was the intended target on the play. So that'll make it third down. I like this play right here. And I'm telling you why. It's a long yarded situation. And this pass play allows your players the ability to convert the first down. The Bruins line up with six defensive back. Back to pass. Looks. Home run ball in the air. Knocked down, incomplete. Number 82 was the intended receiver on the play. And they're going to have to bring on the punt team. It's fourth down. The Trojans are lining up to punt it away. Number 28 will be the return man. He gets it off. He hauls it in at the 46-yard line. Three points was the result of their last drive as the offense heads out for another. First and 10. Ball on the 46-yard line. Number three with three wide receivers. Back to pass. Throws it out there. Swatted away. Excellent job of getting a hand in there to break up the pass. It was, Coach. That one had reception written all over it, but the defender stepped up and made the play. So it's second and ten. Ball on the 46-yard line. Number three comes to the line with three wide. Setting up the play action. Aaron and out long. 
caught. And he's brought down at the 19. And with that last pass, he just went over the 400-yard mark. He's done a very nice job today of getting the ball to the open receivers. And he's been able to do that because of good pocket protection. The guys up front have given him enough time to make the throws. The Bruins go with the I formation. They keep it on the ground with the tailback. They'll bring him down for a loss on the play. He didn't get much on that play at all. Brad, the defense had that play read and sealed it off from the get-go. It's second and 11. Ball on the 20-yard line. UCLA goes with the ace set here. Inside give. Tackle at the 15. Number 28 picks up five with the carry. This play should work out very nicely. Third and six. Ball on the 15-yard line. Number 28 is the single set match. He drops back. He looks. Goes to the end zone. And it's complete for the touchdown. Boy, Kirk, this defense is in big trouble if they continue to give up touchdowns in the air like that. Yeah, that's four now that they've given up. Looks like this quarterback has their number today. The kick is up. And he adds the extra point. And now we're going to take a look at the Pontiac drive summary. UCLA is lining up to kick this one off. Number 22 and number 34 keep to return. And this one's away. He's tackled at the 20. Not a very good series for this offense on their last drive as they were forced into a three and out. Boy, oh boy, they had nothing going last time. Man, maybe, Scooter, you need to get out there and show them what you're made out of. Somebody get me a helmet quickly. Number 25 is a deep back as they line up in the eye. Setting up the play action. Let's it fly. This one is back away. Number eight was the intended target. That'll make it second down. I'd run it off tackle here. Nothing too fancy. Just establish a solid rushing game. One man backfield. Gets the ball. Don't fake under heavy pressure. That makes four sacks today. This defensive front is tough, and they're really, I mean, really fast, too. Well, this speed is difficult to defend because you have to try to keep them off balance so they can't use their quick. Looking, he throws it. And it's caught. And he's finally out of bounds at the 40-yard line. That's just airing it out on third down. That was more than enough to pick up the first down. Next time, this defense will be playing on their heels. They come out with four linebackers. Nice play fake. Surveys the field. Once it all, going deep. Knocked down, incomplete. Number eight was the intended receiver on that pass. So that'll make it second down. Second down, 10 yards to go. On the 40-yard line. They line up with split back. He drops back. He looks. Long ball, right side. Tipped away. Number eight was the intended target on the play. That'll make it third down. It's a big down right here. You gotta throw in this situation. Ball on the 40-yard line. The Trojans come out in the ace formation. Drops back to pass. Looking. He lets it go deep down the middle. It's batted down, incomplete. Number two was the intended receiver on that pass. That's going to bring up fourth down. It's fourth down. The punt team is on the field looking to kick this one away. Number 28 is back deep to return the punt. He gets it off. Back deep to return. 
Number 28 takes it for 21. They'll bring him down at the 23-yard line. They moved the ball very effectively on their last drive, which ended with a touchdown. The defense has been talking it over on the sideline, trying to make some corrections. Let's see if they can stop them this time. One man backfield. And they keep it on the ground with a tackle. And he's tackled at the 25-yard line. Maybe a few, but that's it. What a big hit by that defender. He laid a lick into him. From their own 25-yard line. Second down. They line up in an eye. The counter. He breaks it. Tackle made at the 30-yard line. Five yards. That'll make it third down. You only got a few yards to go for the first, so you just need to rifle the ball in there. Ball on the 30-yard line. UCLA sets up in the eye. Drops back to pass. Looking. Comes across the middle. He goes up and gets it! So on third down, they pick up the first and a lot more. When that kid caught the ball, he wasn't thinking about first down. He was thinking touchdown. From the 42-yard line. First down. UCLA lines up in a double tight set. They'll throw on first down. He's looking. Looking long to the right. Now, who's the penalty going to be called on here? Pass on the and the defense. He got to the receiver a bit too soon there. First down. You won't get much of an argument from me. That was a good call. First, First down, down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 27-yard line. Single set back for you. On the ground with a tailback. And they got to him before he could get back to the line. Man, I sure wouldn't want to be hit by that kid. That's not baby fat on him anymore. He weighs 300 pounds plus. I don't know if I'd be calling him a kid. Well, I'm not the one out there taking the hits either, my friend. The Trojans line up in a nickel back. They'll go with the run once again. They'll bring him down at the 25. The halfback picks up maybe five yards on the draw play. Third it's and third and eight. Ball, Ball on the 25. 25 yard line. Number 36, the lone back. He drops back. Down the middle. The senior makes the catch. And he comes up with his second touchdown catch of the game right there. Kirk, this kid is tough to stop. Yeah, you're right, coach. You try to keep tabs on him, but eventually he's going to find a way to get open. I think you need to double team him. Here's the kicking team to try the extra point. He gets it up. He makes the PAT. That score leads us to our Pontiac drive summary. UCLA, UCLA lines, lines up, up for the kickoff. kickoff. Number 22, back deep to return. And this is just a booming kick. <laughs> and he's taken down at the 26 yard line. And now a slight break in the action as the offense comes out onto the field for their next possession. First We've got a first and 10. Ball, ball on their own 26. Single set backfield. Gets the ball. No, they fake. And he's hammered down. Defense looking sack in the second down and long situation. USC just took their first time out. USC comes to the line, only one man in the backfield. Back to pass, looks, throws it. Number 11, picks it off. A little juke, that's a great tackle at the 40. It's the safety who's in the right place at the right time. The quarterback has to know where the safety is when he makes this kind of throw. Right here, he just tried to force something that wasn't there. This is one of my favorite plays in the playbook. First and 10. 
ball on the 40-yard line. UCLA goes with the ace set here. Ready. Waiting. They'll throw on first down. He throws right. Complete. What a catch. He goes down at the 12 yard line. And he continues to rack up yards through the air. Got over 500 of them. Well, anytime you throw over 500 yards in a game, it either means you're a pretty good passer or that defense just plain stinks. I'll give all the credit to the quarterback here. He's on fire. In the red zone again. Let's see if it'll be another touchdown. They'll throw on first down. Throws. And it's knocked away. Number nine was the intended receiver on the play. That'll make it second down. It's second down. 11 yards out. Number 28 is the single setback. Back to pass. Looking to the end zone. In and out of his hands. Number nine was the intended target on the play. So that'll make it third down. Third down on the 11 going in. The Trojan line up with six defensive backs. Drop back to pass. Looks. Goes to the end zone. Touchdown, Brewer. After that sixth touchdown pass of the day, I don't know what else you can say about this. Guy. I don't think anything's left. He's a great quarterback having a career day. There's not much else you can say. The kick is up, and he tacks on the extra point. So we take a moment to check out the Pontiac drive summary. Number seven is lined up to kick this one off. Kicks it away. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. Let's watch this defense and how aggressive they are. They were able to get a pick the last time, and they're like a wild animal. When they smell blood, they go in for the kill. Take it easy, coach. You're getting excited. Hey, that's right, sweetheart. I'm always excited. Number 25 lines up as a single back. He drops back. Looking. Deep pass down the right side. Batted away. Number eight was the intended target on the play. That'll make it second down. Pitch it to the outside and follow your blockers. It's second and 10. Ball on the 20. Number 25 is the deep back as they line up in the eye. Draw play. They'll drop him for a loss. They couldn't get back to the line of scrimmage on that one. I don't think they did a very good job of selling the pass. The defense was able to read the play and come right in there and make a nice stop. Back to pass. Toss is short. And this one's broken up. He just beat the ball to the receiver's hands on that play. Nice deflection. Yep, and now it's fourth down. Fourth down. The Trojans line up to punt. Number 28, waiting the return. Oh, excellent punt. Number 28, fields at the 39, makes a move. Tackle at the 44-yard line. The offense ready for the first play of this drive. They moved the ball extremely well on their last possession on their way to the end zone. First and 10, ball on the 44. 44-yard line. The Bruins line up in an eye formation. He drops back. Looking. Wants to throw outside. He goes up and gets it. That's just a great call by the coordinator there going to the air on first down. I agree with you 250%. 250% coach? Yep. 250%. That's a great call. And we take a quick look at the stats from within the red zone brought to you by Old Spice Red Zone when performance matters the most. So their last red zone visit resulted in a touchdown. Let's see if the defense can hold them this time. He's tackled at the nine. That's a nice six yard game. That'll bring up second down. It's second and four. Ball on the nine yard line.
UCLA comes out with an eye formation. Here we go. Red 18. Red. Drops back to pass. He tosses it short. It's complete. And they got him for a loss. Nothing going on that one. That'll bring up third down. I just let the players go out there and have some fun here. Third, third and five, five situation. Ball, Ball on the nine. Yard. Number 36 finds up the single back. Setting up the play action under heavy pressure. And this one falls incomplete. For 26, the intended receiver on the play. Fourth this should be an five. easy field goal. Ball the field goal the attempt yard. will be about a 26 yarder. Number seven is lined up for the field goal. The kick is up, and it's through the uprights. And now we'll take a look at the Pontiac drive summary. Number seven looks ready to kick this one off. Number 22. He kicks off. Number 22 fields it at the two. He lost the ball. Number 34 scoops it up, and they recover their own fumble. I'm going to tell you something. This guy has got to do a better job of protecting the football the next First time he ten. gets it. First and ten. Four-yard line. Number 25, alone in the backfield. Drops back to pass. Looks. He throws it. And it falls incomplete. Number eight was the intended receiver on the play. So that'll make it second down. Second it's second down and 10 to go. Ball on the 24-yard line. The Trojans with four receivers. Ready! Green, 88! Green, 88! <laughs> There's the play fake. He's looking. He's going long. This one should be interesting. Pass interference on the defense. The defender got a little too aggressive on that play. Yeah, you're allowed to check a receiver downfield, but once the ball's in the air, you have to let go. And he hung on too long that time. First they line up at the 39. On the First 39 down. Yard line. They come out with a big set. Drops back to pass. Looks. Fires deep down the right side. It's knocked away, incomplete. Coach, you made a nice defensive play there. He sure did. He just stuck his hand out and hit the football. Second, Second down, 10 yards Ball to go. On the Ball on their own 39. USC comes out with two tight ends. Nice play fake. Let's it go. And it's the senior. And a pretty smart call right there. You're absolutely right. The reason why this play worked is that the play action froze the defense just enough to allow the receiver to get open. The Trojans come out in the ace formation. He drops back. Looking. He passes it. Complete. And they bring him down at the 23-yard line. The tight end came up with a nice catch that time. Yeah, nice catch, and he shows off a few moves there. Yeah, the big fella's pretty athletic for a tight end. And as a quarterback, it's always nice to have a big target like this to go to. USC goes with the ace set here. They'll throw on first down. Looking, throws it to the outside. A lot of shoving while the pass was in the air. Let's get the call. Pass on the pass. On the defense. That was a good call. The defender was all over him. Sometimes holding up a defender is better than letting him go for a big game. Or even worse, a touchdown. The pressure turns up when in the red zone, and that's when you turn to Old Spice Red Zone, when performance matters the most. USC comes to the line, only one man in the backfield. Looks, looks to the end zone. Back it away. Number 83 was the intended target on the play. That'll bring up second down. Second down on the eight-yard line. Number 10 comes to the line with three wide. He drops back. 
He's looking. He lets it go. It's batted down. Incomplete. That's just a great defensive play. It won't look like much in the stat book, but that's getting the job done. It's third down. They need eight yards here to get the ball in the end zone. Number 10 with three wide receivers. Here we go. Hunt. Back to pass. He looks, throws it. He goes up and gets it. It's a touchdown. And Coach, how about that touchdown? With that last touchdown throw, this quarterback now has managed to find the end zone three times today. Pretty decent number, if you ask me. It's up. And he converts the extra point. And here's the Pontiac drive summary. They line up to kick this one away. Number 36. He kicks it. Number 36 fields it at the seven. Gets one tackler. A scoring drive the last time out for this offense, and they'll huddle up for this drive. First We've got ten. a first and ten. Ball on the 25-yard line. UCLA comes to the line with three wide. On the ground with a tailback. Kirk, no how about that defensive end getting in there on that play? That is just a great play getting into the backfield. This guy is so quick that the ball carrier never had a chance. Second it's second and down and ten to go. Ball, ball on the 25. 25-yard line. Number 28 lines up as a single back. Here's a draw. Brought down at the 26. That run didn't go far. They'll spot the ball a yard from the line of scrimmage. Now it's third and nine coming up. Ball on the 26-yard line. UCLA goes with the ace set here. Back to pass. Surveys the field. He throws right. Oh, great catch. This one will be interference, but who's it going to be called on? Pass interference on the defense. The penalty is declined. This is where you just go with what you know the best. First, First down, ten. 10 yards to Ball go. Ball on the 40-yard line. Yard line. High formation here. It's a ball. No, they faked it. Throws. He almost had it, but it's incomplete. The defense really missed a golden opportunity there. That's what separates a good player from a great player. When you have a chance like that, you need to take advantage of it. UCLA goes with the ace set here. Nice play fake. Looking. Once and all. And it's the senior. And he's tackled at the 13. What a pretty pass play. This is just a simple play action pass. The defense here bid on the fake just enough, allowing the quarterback to find an open target, and the result is a big gainer. UCLA goes with the ace set here. Here's a draw. Gets the tackler. And they make the stop at the 11-yard line. A two-yard run by the halfback. I like running here in this situation. It's a safer play. Second and eight. Ball on the 11-yard line. They line up in an eye. He drops back. He looks. Let's it fly. Touchdown. Boom. Looked like the defense just forgot about the tight end on that play. Yeah, he seemed to slip right through the secondary and find an opening. I can't believe the defense allowed that to happen. Especially in the red zone, Kirk. They got to be aware of this guy's pass-catching abilities. It's up, and he adds the extra point. And now we're going to take a look at the Pontiac drive summary. UCLA, UCLA ready to kick this one off. Deep to return. He sends it off. 
Number 22 fields it at the 2. They'll bring him down at the 28. So before the offense hits the field, let's take the time to let you know that our game is brought to you by EA Sports. First and 10. Ball on the 28-yard line. Setting up the play action. He passes it. And it's knocked down. You got to be careful throwing in the coverage like that. Well, Coach, I don't think it was a poor decision. It was just a great reaction by the man in coverage. It's second down and 10 to go. Ball on the 28. Gets the ball. No, they fake. Might want it all. Deep ball's got a man. And it's caught to the 20, to the 10. He's all the way. Touchdown. A great throw. And that's his second touchdown catch of the game. The quarterback knew exactly where to put the pass. And the receiver went out there and made the grab. Good communication there. So the kicking team will line up for the point after. It's up. He splits the uprights with the extra point. That score leads us to our Pontiac drive summary. Coach, you got to wonder what they're thinking here. Number 22, back to he kicks it. Number 22 fields it at the 7. And he's tackled at the 27. Time once again for this offense to come back out and start another drive. Just go out and let your receivers make a play. First it's first and ten. and ten. Ball on their Ball own 27. 27 yard line. Number 36 lines up as a single back. Play action. Looks. Tosses short. Can't hang on. Incomplete. Number 81 was the intended receiver on the play. So that will make it second down. Let's see what those big fellows on the line are made of. Second, Second down, down, 10 yards to go. On the 27 yard line. Number three comes to the line with three wide. Let's go! Wide 80! Wide! Hut. Setting up the play action. He's drilled as he throws. Incomplete after the defense got in his face and punished him as he released the football. The offensive line is just opening the floodgates on him. Third down and 10 coming up. Ball on the 27 yard line. Number 36, alone in the backfield. Back to pass. He looks, he passes it. Catches it, and he's shoved out of bounds at the 45. Good job of attacking the coverage to keep the drive alive. That was a great looking pass to move the sticks on third down. UCLA comes out with an eye formation. Ready! Play action. Looking. Long ball, right side. Has it to the senior. And they tackle him at the 11-yard line. Big game there for the first down. There was some miscommunication down there by the defense that allowed for that big game. Yep. you got to stay on your toes every play. Otherwise, you allow plays like that. Another trip to the red zone. Last time, it resulted in a touchdown. Inside give. Bounces off the would-be tackle. They pick up a good six yards there, so that'll make it second down. Six 
Second. It's second and four to go. Five yards yard. to the goal line. The Bruins go with the eye formation. Back to pass. End zone. Incomplete. Almost picked off. They just couldn't capitalize on the bad pass. Yeah, I thought the defender had it, but he couldn't get the pick. The defense will try to stop this third down as they were unsuccessful the first time on this drive. And this place is rocking. Setting up the play action. Looking. Going to the end zone. Number 55 picks it off. Great catch by the linebacker, but not a smart throw from the quarterback. It didn't look like the quarterback even saw the linebacker hanging in that area. It pays to be in the right spot at the right time. This one should keep that offense in check. UCLA will take their first time out of the half. First, First ten. down, 10 to go. On the five -yard line. Number 25 is the single setback. They'll throw on first down. He's looking. Deep pass down the right side. Couldn't haul it in. Number eight was the intended target on the play. That'll make it second down. I'd make sure that the players know to conserve time here on this pass play. One man backfield. Drops back to pass. He tosses it short. They'll bring him down at the eight. Well, the tight end just went over the 100-yard mark with that last catch. You don't see too many tight ends catching that many balls. Well, this guy's a legitimate weapon for the quarterback out there. UCLA lines up in a dime defense here. Ready! Ready, D! Back to pass. Throws it deep downfield. And it's caught. The ball is loose. They fall on it. And he's tackled at the 43. The Trojans take a timeout. And that was their last timeout. I'd call a play like this to make sure that there's no chance that this kid's going to run out of bounds and stop the clock. First and ten. Ball on the 43-yard line. UCLA comes out with an eye formation. They keep it on the ground. With his Number 28 gets three yards on the carry. When you got the ball with the lead, you just want to run it inside and work that clock down. And eight. Ball on the 40-yard line. They line up in an eye. And they make the stop, the 39-yard line. The halfback picks up a yard. In this situation, you got to throw the ball to your best receiver. They line up at the 39. It's third down. EA Sports and Coca-Cola would like to congratulate today's Coke players of the game. Nice job. There's a the play fake. He lets it go. Tipped away. He wasn't letting the receiver get to that one. That's a big play on third down to get a hand in there and break up the pass. I think the quarterback would like to have that one back. Fourth and six. And this will be a very long field goal attempt. Number seven is lined up for the field goal. It's up. And he didn't get all of it, but falls short. Well, fellas, he can't come through with three points. Like corners who get beat on deep routes and quarterbacks who throw a pick, kickers all... First, First down, ten, 10 yards to go. He drops back. He passes it. Incomplete. It's knocked down by the defense. Number two was the intended target on the play. That'll make it second down. Second down, 10 yards to go. Drops back to pass. Surveys the field. Throws. Catches it. Down the sideline. Well, that's just a big-time pass and a big-time play. Oh, yeah. They weren't going just for a first down on that play. They were going for the end zone. USC comes to the line. Only one man in the backfield. Back to pass. 
He looks, throws it. That close to being intercepted. That could have easily been a turnover. I don't even think the quarterback even saw that guy. Well, he almost saw him running the other direction with the football. It's second down and 10 to go. USC lines up with a split backfield. He drops back. He's looking. Throws. And he will score. Great route. Great catch. Great score. That's not the first time this kid's found the end zone. And my friend, I don't think it'll be his last either. Three touchdowns. That is impressive. So we take a moment to check out the Pontiac drive summary. There isn't much time left. This isn't what you'd normally see here. And this one's a short kick. Number 36 takes it to 15. There's a flag on the play. Flag on the play. Let's see what it is. Clipping on the receiving team. That one will put the offense in a hole, and they'll try to get some of that back on this upcoming play. First From their own 16-yard line. First down. Cut. He'll go down to one knee. I call a play like this to make sure that there's no chance that this kid's going to run out of bounds and stop the clock. It's second down and 12 to go. Ball on the 15-yard line. UCLA comes out with an eye formation. UCLA will take their last time out. I'm full of good plays. Try this one. Second and 12 coming up here. Ball on their own 15. And he'll just kneel it here. On the run. Loss of two on the play. When you got the ball with the lead, you just want to run it inside and work that clock Third down. And 13. Ball on the 13 yard line. So this rivalry will have to wait another year to renew their acquaintances. Was this one any different than previous years? Nothing adds to the pageantry of college football more than a good rivalry. This was a great game that should only add more fuel to the fire for next year's matchup. And boy, was it fun to watch. Folks, that's going to do it for this edition of NCAA Football 2007. Again, our final score, the UCLA Bruins, 65, and the USC Trojans, 52. This is Brad Nessler with Kirk Herbstreit and Lee Corso. We thank you for playing, and we'll see you next time. Thank you for attending today's ballgame. Please drive home safely.